Hello, sports fans and baseball fans, and especially Houston Astro and Chicago White Sox fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, and I am here today with a preview of the upcoming division series. I think it's division series or wild card series. I don't know what they call the first round, but anyway, whatever. I'm, I'm here with a preview of the first round of the White Sox and um, Houston Astros playing each other in the playoffs. The first round of the playoffs between the White Sox and the Astros. That's what I'm trying to say. Now, if you are out there and you're looking around for other previews of other series, maybe, you know, you're a San Francisco fan, you want to know what I think about the San Francisco um, Giants versus whoever might win their series, or you're looking for the one game playoff series previews, or you're looking for any other preview that doesn't involve the White Sox, guess what? You're not going to find it. Because history tells me that these previews do not do that well. And Lord knows this one may not. So I'm putting it up though because I am a White Sox fan and the White Sox for the first time in their history, a hundred years plus the White Sox have been around. This is the first time in their history that they have been to the postseason two consecutive years. They went to the postseason last year and they were eliminated in the first round by the Oakland Athletics. And they are back to take on the Houston Astros. And I'm going to give you a quick overview of what that series looks like in a nutshell. And again, as we go over this, do not take this as gospel. I'm not the manager of either team, so I don't know if these are the people that will be playing what position and what. This is just my impression of what's going to happen or what likely will happen or what very well might happen. Now, the one thing I do want to say is this is a best of five series. So the... Um, Teams will not be going with a five-man rotation because they do not need to use a five-man rotation. And in fact, once the playoffs get underway, and even when we go to the best of seven series, is they probably still don't need to have a five-man rotation. So we're only going to have a four-man rotation or show a four-man rotation or talk about a four-man rotation. And... Um, with that having been said, I will get my big noggin out of the way so that you can see what I got on my board. And then I will talk about it. All right, so the first thing we got over here is the White Sox. The Chicago White Sox. And I've got Grandall at catcher, which is very likely as long as he is healthy and ready to play, and he seems to be. First base of Breu. Second base, Hernandez. Shortstop, TA. TA7, Timmy Anderson. Third base, Moncada. Left field, Jimenez. Center field, Luis Robert. Right field, I'm going to go with Gavin Sheets. I don't know if Gavin Sheets will be on the roster. I don't know if he'll play, but if he's on the roster, he probably will be the right fielder at least versus right-handed pitching. And then I've got D.H. Leary Garcia, because Garcia always seems to play. No matter what, doesn't matter. La Russa loves the guy, I think. So I would project their four-man rotation to be Giolito, Lance Lynn, Dylan Cease, and Carlos Rodon. Now, um, Cease, Lynn and Giolito have been pretty consistent and very good. Cease is kind of a Jekyll and Hyde. He, every other start is horrible. So hopefully the last one he had was horrible so, so that this next one that he has can be good. So that brings us to the bullpen. Now, since Keuchel has been in their rotation this year, I would project that Keuchel will not be playing in the starting, he will not be pitching in the starting rotation because he has been 
Uh, of late, he has been pretty bad. And I would say of the five Chicago, main Chicago starters, he's the worst of the five. So I would expect LaRusso to use him as a lefty out of the bullpen. Then you would have Kimbrel, Hendricks, Tapera, Lopez, Bummer. Kimbrel and um, Tapera, of course, we got from the Cubs in a, a deal, a deadline deal. So the record on the year, this is the White Sox, have been 93 and 69. That was their final record on the year. And they were 2 and 5 this year versus Houston. And on a very uh, concerning note, they were 27 and 29 versus uh, teams with a 500 plus record. So uh, that's, you know, certainly not good. Now over here you got the Houston Astros, and the Houston Astros will be the home team in this series. So uh, three, if it goes five games, three of the five games will be in Houston. You got Maldonado at catcher. First base is Yuri Gurriel. Second base is El Tuve. Shortstop would be Correa. Third base, Almeidas Diaz, because I think. Um, from what I can gather, um, what's his name? Their regular third baseman, and again, his name uh, disappears from my head. But I think he's injured. He may be out with an injury of some sort, so it would be Diaz at third. Left field is Brantley. Center field is Myers. Right field is Kyle Tucker. And the DH, Jordan Alvarez. I think that's his name. I would project their starting rotation to be Greinke, McCullers, Odorizzi, and Urquidy. And their bullpen to be Phil Maton, Ryan Presley, Ryan Stanek, uh, I think that's Blake Taylor, I'm not sure, Kendall Graveman, and uh, Framber Valdez. Framber Valdez, I would normally kind of like Keuchel, he would normally be a starter, but they are not going to need him to start. So I would say he probably is in the bullpen for them. Their record this year, the Houston Astros were 95 and 67, won the Western Division, just as the same as we won the Central. Uh, they were five and two against Chicago, which makes sense if we were two and five against Houston. And I read something online where the odds makers are, are giving the Houston Astros a 54% chance of winning the series. No one in their right mind would bet against the Chicago White Sox. But anyway, um, so yeah, there's the matchup. It doesn't really bode particularly well for the White Sox, but then again, that's why you play the games. And you don't just do a stratomatic or out of the ball, out of the park ball, uh, baseball simulation and say, okay, this is who wins. You actually go out there and you actually play the games and then you see who actually wins the game. Let's hope the White Sox do it. If you like this video, leave me a thumbs up. If you want me to do uh, other uh, postseason matchups, I would say too bad because I'm not going to. But leave a comment below, thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to my channel, subscribe to the channel. And then, you know, who knows? Maybe in the future I will do all the playoffs. But anyway, that's going to be it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.